three points pushed through forever. The two legionaries rooted through the armory of their deposed emperor. They swept the rubble aside and lifted a bow of sharp metal, its thin frame of blackened blades bound with wire. This is the one the scions made so you can't miss. Oh? How'd they do it? They put time in it. What kind of time? Kind so when you shoot, that's always when the arrows hit. You never miss? Not unless you are going to anyway. But if you do miss, it'll make it a time that you don't. Right. Unless this time was a time when you did. It was the third day of the dry joining. Tiku's voice was rasped raw, but he still clutched the bow to his chest and held it placid in his mind. Tiku melded his thoughts with the null, a bastardized meta-concert, one voice in the expanse, a temporal harmony of one. Three arrows hissing faintly with solar power bristled in his fist. Then an echo, a rusty whine of horsehair on frayed wire. Tiku plucked the bowstring. Spots of blood appeared on the floor. He plucked again, filling the air with oppressive vibration. Blood welled from his fingers and dripped to match the pattern at his feet. How's it my arrows? They come from time, because they got put there before. When you shoot it, how's it know what heads to hit? It goes in time and gets a future where heads always had arrows in them. But which heads, though? The ones that had arrows already. Tiku's mind emptied itself, dissipating across the pitch and froth of what was to be. Time was an empty wheel around him. His song held it, and the joining pinned it in place. Three points of harmony between the will and the physical. His fist rose. Three shafts pierced the Y-shaped pupil. They had always been there. Three points pushed through forever. <laughs>